Oh my 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 oh my 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 oh my 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 Tesla stock is down in the after hour. Elon Musk got like eight days to raise forty four billion dollars to buy Twitter. Or else a judge is gonna be really mad. And I don't think you want to make judges mad. Hey, what do I know? Here, we look at the first atmospheric river of water year 2023. To bring some serious precipitation to Washington and Oregon later this week. And probably even you, the Canada. So, if you're in these zones, I will be watching out. Hey, Northern California. You may also be getting wet too. Hey, pop a tapel, volcano, and people around it, you're on kind of an alert because apparently the base of the volcano is growing or something like that. Also, friends in Mexico, watch out. You got a hurricane coming your way. Bam, right about there. See that? I don't know where this exact area is, but that looks like at least a Category 1, possibly Category 2 coming your way. This would be on the 23rd, and then you got snow coming too. And people say a pretty bad storm. Around the 26th. Will it happen? I don't know, man. We'll see. But I'll be watching out. Weather's been kind of boring lately here in the USA, in my opinion, after the big hurricane. Oh, but we got a lunar Scorpio eclipse coming, I think, on the 25th. You got Saturn turning retrograde on the 23rd. And then it's going to be like a Taylor Swift weekend because she's releasing a new album. The last two albums, I went live and listened live, and like a thousand people tuned in to watch me listen live last time last two times which is weird man the future is weird huh holy crap Ola. seattle air quality is off the charts bad tonight this dude was running a coursey roast in the box in every room is that even legal all right anyway you got a bunch of people saying hey shell worth keeping an eye on the finer details, next weather maker to cross the country has the chance of a kickoff strong, severe weather anywhere from the Great Lakes to the Texas coast. This includes Monday night's chance. So if we're talking about a big storm, possibly next week, that means probably pretty serious possibilities. And remember all those people who are like, hey, one day the world is going to be invaded by mooses, meese, and they're going to be pissed off and they're going to be chasing you off of your soccer fields. Well, those prophets were totally correct as angry moose were chasing people in Wyoming today. And football, is that what they call in Wyoming? Or I guess soccer. Game was delayed. Yeah, I mean, um, it was the best of times, it was the worst of times. Um, thank you, super duper thank you to, to Teresa and Tyler and Cody and everybody in Astro Fight Club for all the love and all the support over the years. You guys are amazing. My hackers have been like super duper freaking out on me on my phone for like a week. I don't know what's up there, but they always get really weird this time of the season. But I guess that's what it is. Holiday season, because we are in the forefront of the holiday season. Some people get like extra happy, extra optimistic, extra grateful, and then just try to do their best and do better to Christmas. I'm one of those people. I'm like a Christmas spirit. And then some people get grinchier and grumpier and angrier and displaced or aggressionier. And remember, Mars is about to go retrograde. I think on the 30th, that's going to be some crazy shit. Because the people who are used, usually attacking and always on offense, they never know what to do. And sometimes they break their dick off in the dirt. We don't want that to happen. So stay cool, be cool, and do your best to have a good holiday season this year and i heard a rumor americans would be able to keep more of their paychecks up front and deduct starting more next year due to all the inflation or whatever well in metaverse people spend like hundreds of thousands if not millions of dollars buying digital land in a digital universe and would you buy land in the middle inverse universe some investors are saying now please buy meta land or you can just buy like a playstation 5 which i did my inner child was super happy. Webbing around the city is Miles Morales in New York. I was just webbing around and I was like, wow. Didn't cost me hundreds of thousands of dollars, though. It was expensive. I'll give you that. 
John Homenuck doesn't rhyme with crunk. All right, that was dumb. Anyway, yeah, we're watching a potential storm which could affect parts of the Northeast U.S. later this weekend into Monday. Complex mid-upper level evolution, vorticity splitting off and troughs and shit. Oh, we'll be watching. Also, I'm like 95% Norwegian, so the cool and sometimes cold air feels great to me. And in Texas, it's been like 30, 40, 50 degrees, 60. It's been wonderful, super duper. And I heard it's going to get cold in California, A, which can't be true because I heard it's always perfect weather there. Asterisk. Let's watch together. You and I. Fukusako Rujima pumping ash into the sky. Yep. Volcano. Ash. Dust. Bit of lava. Over in Japan. Did you hear BTS, which is a South Korean band worth billions, is going to have to go into the military? It could actually hurt South Korea's economy. That's a weird story. I would guess, though, their songwriting may improve after. I mean, I helped Jimi Hendrix. I hope you're doing well. I hope you're doing great. I hope you're fantastic. But put a jacket on. And don't feel too embarrassed to wear earmuffs and mittens if you want, you know. Anyway. Oh my gosh, it's getting cold. It's weird, man. To think that, like, I've had millions and millions and millions of people watch my channel. Um, and my 10-year anniversary is coming up on the 23rd of November. So I'll be forced to look back on all the time spent as your planetary defense commander doing my best to help us all avoid World War III prevent civilization from collapsing and trying to have as much fun as possible in life. But hey, watch out for hurricanes. The hurricane season is not over yet. And I'm definitely talking to you, Mexico. Peligro, that means danger. The rumors are the Pilarca volcano is erupting. How are you doing? Oh, we still got 35 days of Jupiter retrograde. Can't wait till it goes direct. What about the boat goat? We're talking about the brightest gamma ray burst of all time brightest of all time boat you know goat greatest of all time boat goat get it get on the goat boat and do it again let's have a big explosion with all of our friends in the best kind of ways somebody out there's probably pissed off like man i'm mad at thor news he's been telling us for almost 10 years that we would survive we would make it and the world would not end and that we should stay cool and be grateful and be good to our friends and our family appreciate god and you know jesus christ is my thing but i respect your right to believe whatever you want to believe oh look weather deck showing us swirly mix swirl face part of the storm conditions that will be moving into the pack northwest that we talked about at the beginning of the video my, 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 So, do you think one of those new Taylor Swift songs is going to even partially be about me? At one point, Elon was like, yo, dude, I'm totally done selling Tesla stock. But he said that a couple of times, and then he sells stock again. And so I'm wondering, dude, raising $44 billion at a time where, you know, like Tesla stocks crashed 50% from its highs, and Bitcoin's crashed like 72% from its highs that, and, and they keep saying, like, recession, recession, recession. And it's going to get worse. Jeff Bezos today was like, oh, my God, the economy, we're in trouble. And uh, so it's got to be a bad time to try to raise $44 billion, especially since. Anyway, so we'll see what happens. It's interesting. Elon, there's always a fresh angle to his story, like, every single day. He likes being that guy that everybody talks about every day. If you ever danced with an alligator in the pale moonlight. Wait, what? All right. I gotta say, though, you know, Trump, Elon, Kanye seems more formidable than Trump, Rudy Giuliani, and the My Pillow guy. But I don't know if that's really saying much. I, I don't know, man. I think between the three of them, they've got like 10 divorces. Now, you know, which is just an interesting stat. I don't know, man. Okay. Yeah, it's a dangerous world. And who you choose to make out with or marry. And some of the most important decisions you'll ever make. Extremely heavy rains, floods, and landslides hit Pernambuco, leaving 90 people dead and dozens missing in Brazil. 
Um, you know, a lot of times people are like, whoa, that made me cringe. Talking about some very minor thing in life. Nobody ever died from cringing. So play defense. That was a weird segue. Anyway, what was it talking about? Do you ever fall asleep listening to ASMR? Anyway, ASMR Glow. Uh, she asparagus tweeted me. That's good luck, right? And it looks like ASMR Gibby brought her A game with the pre production and the production and the production value. I plan to step up my A game in the next week or two or three or whatever. Man, so you know that Nord or whatever the pipeline was called that connect, I think, Germany to Russia or Europe to Russia with natural gas or oil or whatever. Anyway, it looks like they blew a giant hole in it. Whoever did, whoever's really good at um, deep undersea explosive shit. Anyway, hit the button, baby. I love you. I should wrap this one up. It's 11 minutes. Stay cool. God bless everyone.